Ahead for Giannis. To the corner. One more pass. And Giannis is all alone at the basket. Gimbo Walker. Here comes Aaron and Gomez. Walker inside. Hits and knocks it out. But it goes to Charlotte. Marvin Williams. Three on the way. Batum. And the Bucks escape Charlotte with a 113-112 victory. The players, you know, they're they're always the key. We want to play together. We want everybody to participate, and you know, just to hopefully keep a belief in, in themselves. I guess maybe individually, but in a, a belief in what we're doing. And um, sometimes you can get caught standing and watching Giannis. You can get caught standing and watching Chris and those guys. And the more we can just keep moving and keep the ball moving and playing together, you know, we keep hammering that. It has been fun. Three-point shooting. You want it, you get it. 17 for 47 for the Milwaukee Bucks tonight. Giannis finds Bledsoe off the tip. Bledsoe finds Giannis off to you. Now, this is a young basketball team. First time in 13 years, the Bucks start the season 3-0 after taking down the New York Knicks, 124-113. So Bledsoe has to give it up. Posting up, Middleton against Scharge. Yes. When we're getting stops and we're good defensively, and we get out in transition and we play with spacing and we share the ball, um, we can be good on both ends. So finds him. 123-108 the final. Just the third time in franchise history that Milwaukee has been 4-0. By all accounts, this guy really knows what he's doing. He's got a star player to build around and a team that's got some really nice young pieces around him. I think it's a great fit. I think I think you couldn't have done much better than Mike Budenholzer. Nice. Great job by Ilya Sova. He wanted the foul. He held off. Bucks big winners over the Timberwolves here in Minneapolis on Friday night, 125-95, improving to 5-0 for the first time since 1971. Wonderful guy, did a lot of things. Steven Chenzo at the rim. Arnie would have loved that basket. Middleton screened by Lopez, goes around it, backs up on Bamba, takes a three-pointer over him, got it! Yeah, Milwaukee right now has got great spacing and good pace with Bud as the coach. And their shooters are making shots, which makes everything different. And boy, you found it out and the guy nails that three. Yeah. Their shooters are making shots, which is why they're 6-0. and The Bucks' undefeated run under coach Mike Budenholzer continues as the 6-0 and Raptors come to town to take on the 6-0 and Bucks, the two lone remaining undefeated teams in the NBA. You let it fly and you try to play together. Move the basketball. Positionless. Three-point shooting. Ilya Sova. That's what I'm talking about. And I'll be honest. You know, just in the first couple minutes here. Let's go. Maker. Only one remains in the unbeaten ranks. It's the Milwaukee Bucks. 7-0 and on the season. That ties a franchise best start. 7-0 and from the 1971-72 team. We had uh, good depth and a good starting team. This Milwaukee Bucks team was a classic example of what happens when you play as a team. Know your roles. Complement one another. And together, you serve to reach one goal. You know, we got to keep working and keep, uh, you know, trying to get better tomorrow. And we've got really good players. The roster here, I think, is is uh, in, was in a great place. You know, they're working hard in practice. Um, you know, they're working hard on their games individually. And you know, so I think they're going out. And you know, when they see advantages, they see opportunities. Uh, within the confines of what we do and still trying to play unselfishly, um, you know, I think there's a lot of positives to build on.